bored. Welcome to Amira 7. Some thoughts to ponder of what we're going to do this summer. How are we going to entertain ourselves during this pandemic? It's summertime again. Wishing you're on the beach right now, enjoying the sun, the water, and the sand. But due to COVID-19, we are stuck at home just dreaming about the beach. But we want to engage our kids or students into something worthwhile this summer. So, to ease the boredom, you can make it exciting by doing online games, introducing Word Wall. Our video tutorial how to make online games using Word Wall. So, here's how. First, type Word Wall and log in. If you don't have an account yet, Make sure to sign up using your Google account by following the steps stated. Second, click Create Activity to make a new game. Third, choose the kind of game you want to make from the list given. In my case, I have chosen Find the Match. What we're going to do for the fourth step is to type and make content for your game. Next, you write the title. Now, since it's about find the match, I will be dealing with Bible pairs to be specific. Next is you type the content for your game. What they're going to do is to find the leading lady of the given male character. I, you write the instruction, identify the wife or husband of the following characters. So, you number one, you write the male character on the right side corner, you write the female character. You can even click the image there to put the picture of the said character. If you don't want to type the name of the character, so the choices might be images only. To add another question or option or item, click Add Item. Minimum of three questions or three items. And then you click Done if you are through with your test or game. So in this test item, I have given only five male characters and their leading ladies. What the students will do is to find or pair the matches. So I have given five here. We have here number five. We have Abraham and his wife is Sarah. The sixth item that I typed here is Moses and his wife is Sephora. This game is very appropriate for level 3 for Sunday schools. Now you can edit if you want. Once you're done with the test item, then click done. And here's the preview of the game. What we're going to do is, once the name appears, you click the correct partner of that female character.
With the same content, you can even change the game as long as it matches. So I've changed the name of the game to another type. So matching type still, all you need to do is drag the name of the character on top and place it on the side. Now if I'm done, then I can have another type of game. So it's up to you what do you think or wish what do you wish to use as your Bible game? So there are four choices and choose one that best pair with a given female character. So for Sarah, the choices are given. Then you have Sephora for Moses again. Now, Once you're done with the test, you can check the leaderboard to, to, to know your ranking in that particular game. Then write your name. Now, it shows here that you're the first one to take the test. That's why you rank number one. You can even view the test and your correct answers and even the results. Now, here, if you wish to check on your games or activities, you just click the said game let's say for pronoun agreement antecedent i want to check how many have already taken the test now it will show you just click my results and you will know already the students who took the test and their scores here's the good news this game is for free but sad to say you only have five free games now you wish to upgrade then you can do so but you need to pay so what i am doing so i won't pay anymore i just edit the previous games that i have made i change the content so here's another one this is good for pupils now, if you noticed here, I have already used up my five games. So, what I did, I just edit content. Now, I edit the content. Now, if you wish to change the choices, this game, Labeling, is very good for elementary pupils. The subject is computer, parts of a computer. What I'm doing here is you can even change the theme now it could be rodeo the music and the pictures are using the wild wild west now all you need to do is drag the arrow and place it to the correct object as you label the different parts of a computer as simple as that you see it's very engaging and very interactive for our students the question is how will the kids access the game so you need to set your game then click set assignment you can set up the assignment by writing the deadline. Just scroll below to customize your game according to your preference. Now, if you noticed, you have there, show answers, leaderboard, start again. Now, you can even tell the students whether to write your name or you will only allow one answer or two answers. Lastly, copy the link and you can send it to them through Google Classroom, Zoom, or any other platform. They can access the test as long as they have the link. Now, if there are also games made by other members that you can access if you are so busy to make one. There are different games for all ages to make learning enjoyable, engaging, and fun. So happy making online games! 
Thank you so much for watching. Learning is a lifelong process. Stated in Proverbs 12, 24, work hard and become a leader, be lazy and become a slave. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. See you!